right, what is going on? We got some updates today. I'm excited. First off, it's uh, January 23rd, and I'm headed to work right now. I just have a weird shift. It's from 6 to 10. There's going to be nothing going on, so I'll probably be chilling a little bit, honestly. But, yeah, so anyways, yeah, I got some updates. Um, let's see, I think last video I showed you guys my, um, <clears throat> my three videos, how they were doing. Um, they're still doing alright. I posted one so far today. And yeah, I think one of them, like those ones were sitting at like around a thousand or something like that. So, you know, okay, but definitely need some work. But this video is going to be about the TikTok affiliate. I figured that out a little bit or just kind of tested things out. And we got a little bit of success. Um, no sales right now, but our views are looking good. <clears throat> Anyway, so I don't have the what you call it. I don't have the follower requirement to set up a TikTok affiliate account. So I did it through my TikTok seller account. If you guys are wondering and you guys want to do it too, I made a seller account and I hooked it up to an account and then marketed those products from there. So that's the kind of setup I did, and I already had that ready to go. But I decided, I found some accounts that were just posting videos about products. And a lot of times I didn't even have the product. They were just showing a picture of it. And so I was doing that. I decided to test that out. I just picked some random products, honestly. I picked a pair of pants. Also, you guys have a picture on screen. Um, and as well as the account views. But yeah, so I did a pair of pants, did some like creatine, did like a shirt some tech gadget which I honestly thought the tech gadget was pretty cool that video didn't do the best but I was like damn I might have to buy that yeah so we got those posted and I was just I posted some more this morning I woke up at like six actually no I meant to wake up at six so I got up at 7 30 um, but I posted a video edited uh, my YouTube video posted that as well as posted those three videos so it's a good morning which we got a new subscriber so what's up thank you for joining i really appreciate it and i hope you stick around i'm excited to see uh and, you know see the growth that we can get together so i was excited to tell you guys that my like first video got like i don't know i'm gonna show a picture but it got like a thousand views on tiktok which is the highest i've ever gotten on tiktok so i was excited but i posted three like right in a row and the second one got, it blew up for my standards. It got like 6,000 views. It started at 4,000 and then slowly went up to 5,000. And now it's at 6,000, I believe. And so yeah, I was hyped. But, and then the third video did pretty well. It got like 2,300, something like that. And so I posted another wave three like the next day. I can't remember. Yeah, I think that was yesterday. And it was kind of the same thing. Like, one of them did okay, like low, like 700. One of them did really good. It got up to like that 5,000, 6,000 again. And, uh, excuse me. And one of them did decent again. It got to like 2,000 or 1,000, something like that. It was pretty similar. But today, I posted one, waited a little bit, then posted two and three. And the first one kind of. Flopped. I mean, it wasn't that bad. It got like seven, eight hundred views. Um, I kind of tested things out. I used the, um, I don't know what feature that is, but it's like you can add, it's like a moment and you can like add yours to it. I don't know exactly what it does. I would just throw it on screen to see if it helped. Apparently it did it, but I think it can help. I think just TikTok likes it when you use their new features, which makes sense. You know, they're gonna boost the um, videos that use their new features and advertise a product because that's what they're trying to build right now. So like, it makes sense, just logically. But anyways, my second video was doing slow, but then it popped up into like that 
4,000 area. So I was feeling decent about that, you know. Um, and my third video, I don't know. It was like a little bit less. It was like a thousand something. But I just checked it before I like got in my car. And man, it was a good feeling because I checked and it was like 233 people like like the post it was like 14 favorites and then like only one follow after all this i don't know it's weird i'm at like three followers no i'm not by more now i'm up to like seven but i have like a total well that video got right now it's in at twenty five thousand views so no sales which is like you know a bummer which i kind of expected one but yeah but twenty five thousand views i mean that blows anything we've done out of the water so kind of hype right now I don't know if you can you can see the excitement but yeah, I'm feeling good I'll let you guys know probably tomorrow what the video ends up at I'm not sure how much it's climb it's gonna climb you know I mean I never hit this point on TikTok before so we'll see but yeah but honestly like I'm totally you know that was 25 I got like two of them at like five or six so we're sitting like around 40,000 views but only like seven followers and I think one of them's my other account one of them's my like girlfriend's account so I don't know if that's common for TikTok but I was like you know like I got 48 subscribers on this YouTube channel from a video that got like 500 something views so I mean I know it's a different platform it's different there than compared to YouTube but and I wasn't showing my face in those videos well, you know, I just feel like the follower conversion would be a little bit better. Um, but yeah, so, I don't know, I'm really excited about that. I feel like this has been my biggest success right now, even though I haven't had a sale, but it's like, I haven't had a sale regardless. So yeah, I'm feeling good about that. I want to keep those up going. I kind of want to, I'm not sure how to frame my TikTok shop. Also, I can't display my, um, like my products. Like I have them in my like showcase but I don't know how to display my showcase because it was like I'll like view my products and it's like oh I don't have any products added but I go to like the seller marketplace and it's asking me to put like warehouse information like I'm the seller which maybe that's like the difference between not having the followers like once you get the followers you can um actually like put that in more like officially you know what I mean because technically I'm I guess this is not count for my own product so I think maybe that's why I'm not 100% sure it's kind of a specific question you know it's hard to just find that on a YouTube video um but yeah so I'm feeling good about that I think I can just continue to post and grow and as we get followers and things like that will be able to start making sales and i think this could be really good i found this account that it was just a dude you know like i was saying doing the same thing and he had a lot of like he had like seven million likes total and let's see yeah i looked on his showcase and it said like he had like 30k followers but like 14.8k things sold i'm pretty sure and i think that's like what he's actually sold so you know for i don't know because some products you only get like less than a dollar for affiliate but others you get a couple bucks to like 10 bucks you know what i mean sorry about that my fucking phone said it ran out of storage but anyway so if his um average like sale was only like two three dollars that'd still be like I think three dollars was like forty four thousand four hundred. So, you know, TikTok shop didn't come out that long ago. So I'm sure bro was doing like ten k per month, kind of. So that's really exciting just to know that that's possible. So I think I kind of lost my train of thought, but yeah, I think I really want to get into that and kind of just see how best to frame myself, whether I go for like a personal brand aspect or just kind of do what I've been doing, which is like faceless. But yeah, so I'm going to look into that. Um, I'm not sure if I'm going to record tonight. I think it's supposed to be really foggy. I don't know. We'll just kind of see. I think that's pretty much the majority of what I wanted to say, though. And 
oh yeah and last thing is i want to like with the boost of that product i really want to get my tiktok going pick my personal brand and have like a series to help boost that as well as if i can do my drop shipping and put it on the shop and find a product that's from the us <clears throat> i think that would help the boost too so i think that's going to be try to be my focus just because i've seen so much success so quickly with it that i'm definitely going to look into that and yeah i think when, that's my next step so not sure if i'm going to pick up later or not but i'll see you guys later